Film resistors are made by sputtering the required amount of resistor material on an insulating substrate. Usually, the resistance of each such resistor is adjusted to the required value using laser processing. In the event of resistors designed for mounting in holes, the film applied to the ceramic or glass substrate is covered by a spiral pattern. This forms somewhat of a throttle with high inductance. There exist non-inductive film resistors. They are made according to the technology which helps minimize inductance. Another result of such spiral pattern is an increase in the parasitic capacitance of the resistors. The resistors designed for surface mounting are made as a single band of resistor material with output located on its ends. One of the methods for adjusting such resistors is applying a pattern on such band with the help of a laser. This helps minimize the effective width and increase the effective length. Inductance of such resistors is a lot lower than in spiral adjustment methods. It's also important to go through the reference data on the manufacturing technology of the selected resistor just to make sure that its noise characteristics are suitable for the required application. First of all, noise impacts the bleeder of the steering pulse circuit. Various film technologies are described by various dependencies of noise upon temperatures. They are also different with respect to sustaining short-term voltage surges. If you need a resistor that would operate on its maximum capacities, it is important to find out its pulse and overload parameters provided in the reference documentation. Film resistors come with different allowable deviations from the rated values. The film resistors with 1% or 0.1% allowance are advantages in that they have a more accurate set of rated values. It would be fair to suggest that building a circuit with the help of standard rated resistance without having to use an adjustable resistor and set output voltage in the laboratory might be a lot easier.